Here is part 11 of my blank DVD collection in which you're looking at a disc that contains yet another four films. They were all recorded off various movie channels in 2006. And what we have here are Jungle Fever, Taking Care of Business, Internal Affairs, and Indecent Proposal. Jungle Fever is from 1991. Taking Care of Business and Internal Affairs are from 1990. And Indecent Proposal is from 1993. All right, so we'll go ahead and take a look at the contents of this disc. We'll see how each movie opens on their respective movie channels. I'm gonna make sure the TV's at a volume where it needs to be of 20. And I need to put the TV on the right channel here in a bit. It takes it a second for me to switch the channel. Come on. That's better. Yeah, and there's no extra features or anything on here, so let's just go ahead and get right to it. Let's start with Jungle Fever. Recorded off HBO Signature. Awesome ident there. And then you have the HBO feature presentation logo. And Jungle Fever is rated R, containing strong sexual content, adult content, and adult language. Made by Universal Pictures, of course. This was uh, just after Universal finished celebrating their 75th anniversary. And Spike Lee made this film along with Mo Better Blues and Do the Right Thing. Those two were released before this one. So there's Jungle Fever. Let's go over to Taking Care of Business, which is a Hollywood Pictures movie. This was recorded off Encore. The following feature is rated R. It's rated R for adult content and adult language. I think this was the second or third film made by Hollywood Pictures. I'm not 100% sure. I know the first film made by Hollywood Pictures was Arachnophobia. So there's Taking Care of Business. Let's go over to Internal Affairs. There's the Davis Entertainment logo, and it was recorded off Five Star Max. All right. As I mentioned, Internal Affairs is from 1990. It's a crime drama, which stars Richard Gere and Andy Garcia. And it's rated R. Yeah, all the movies on this disc are rated R, so this one has violence, brief nudity, and adult language. Made by Paramount Pictures, of course, so it'll have the Paramount Communications byline. There's your proof. And the byline is in yellow, too. Last one. Indecent Proposal. There's a Warner Brothers domestic pay TV logo. I forget uh, what aired before this movie. And Indecent Proposal aired on Cinemax. I recorded it off Cinemax back in 2006. It's a romantic drama featuring Robert Redford, Demi Moore, and Woody Harrelson. I've seen this movie before and it's actually okay. I mean, it's not the greatest movie I've ever seen, but it's also not the worst either. Even though I know it got the worst, uh, pic the worst picture award, Razzie Award. And here's a look at what would be on Cinemax that night. Indecent Proposal, Domino, and Max After Dark. Take a look at the Cinemax I did. That's going up right here. That's pretty cool. And Indecent Proposal, as I mentioned, is rated R. And this film contains brief nudity, adult content, and adult language. This is also a Paramount Pictures film, so it will have the Paramount Communications byline. It wouldn't be until 1995 when they would change the Paramount byline to a Viacom company, which still exists to this day. So it's been a Viacom company for 25 years. But back at this point, it was a Paramount Communications company. 
And there you have it for part 11 of my blank DVD collection. Part 12 will come in good time.